Since I've been in Illinois, I've been able to get access to a lot of resources. There's tons of collaboration around Illinois. I work with people in other departments. I get to meet students in other departments and professors in other departments. The stuff that we do, rheology, everything between kind of soft and hard things, actually is really relevant to cooking. There's something called molecular gastronomy that sort of plays with all of those textures in food. Mostly what we do is we characterize these materials and try to figure out ways that we can take advantage of all of their interesting properties to sort of improve engineering design. The summer before I started at University of Illinois, I, my advisor set up an internship at DuPont. Uh, it's a chemical company and that's actually grown into recently a collaboration uh, through a funded project. Um, but we also do collaborations with other departments. I have a collaborator in the systems engineering area where we're working kind of on uh, vibration isolation systems and bridging the two sort of design optimization from their side and what we know about these interesting materials from our side to try to solve problems in a better way. Funding is crucial when you're a graduate student. Um, no one expects to be making a lot of money, but we need to survive. But I found at Illinois, my first year I was offered a fellowship, which was great. And since then, my advisor has been able to support me through research. I haven't had any problem with money, which is good. Champaign is definitely a small town. Um, I didn't grow up in a small town, so it's a little different for me. But it has lots of access to pretty much everything you need. There's shopping, there's sort of theater with the Craner Center. Um, there's lots of people, especially people the same age as graduate students around. So it's easy to meet people. There's lots of interesting things like the Urbana Farmer's Market is a better farmer's market than I've seen anywhere in the country. And so there's lots of great access to those things. Um, it's quiet but it's also got plenty going on if you seek it out. I found that I was given a lot of freedom to sort of explore whatever I wanted to do research-wise. And even since then, when I do have money that's more tied to specific projects, it's still very flexible that my advisor will have me kind of come up with my own ideas and explore them on my own and see what direction they go. Uh, and kind of help guide me along that way, but won't force me into anything I don't enjoy doing.